So here are the little the little mice. They just ate. And I just gave them I know they look bigger, but they're really still looking tiny as you can see. But they've got lots more fur. Their little feet ain't like getting big. You can see their ears are separating from their head. Their little eye slits. I don't know if you can see this. I'm gonna try to see it. See the little eye slits are becoming more apparent, so I think their eyes are gonna be opening pretty soon. And this is Tippy. Tippy, I call him Tippy because he's got a tip on, of white on his tail, which makes me tell the difference between the two of them. Tippy is very active and actually cleans his face, which is kind of interesting. He licks his feet and rubs his face, and he's looking looks like he's rounding around for food. Um, but look at the, I give him a every time I feed him, I give him a little bath, and meaning just I wet my fingers with warm water and I just rub their fur and then I dry them off quickly. They don't have much fur. Look, see, he's just likes to snuggle, just laying down on my hand. But anyway, this is the last, the last of my feedings with frickin' frack here. And um, then they will be going off to the wildlife rehab person. And I'm going to be putting them, I keep them in with a hot water bottle, um, two bottles with hot water in them. See, he's very strong, like he's clinging to my finger. He climbs, I don't know if you can see, see him climbing? Gotta get off my finger here, buddy. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'll pick up, pick up bro over here, or sister or whatever. See, this the other one. So they've seemed to do quite well on this um, formula that I've been feeding them, which is a kid goat um, colostrum replacement. Up, oh, not oh, what are you doing upside down there, bud? Um, but anyway, you can see they're pretty active and pretty strong, like really strong. I'm surprised how look at how strong they are. Like, just crazy. So. These guys had a big will to survive, so I figured I was the one that disturbed their nest, and I had to do everything to make sure that they could at least at least have one run in the field before they become um, part of nature. But I think they look pretty good. I think they look pretty good. And this is what I was feeding them. Um, a little bit more watered down than um, what their recommendations were. I mixed it according to their recommendations and then added hot water at each feeding. Um, but anyway, as you can see, I think it's, I think it's worked quite well. Because I think these guys are, are looking pretty good. And I think in a few weeks they'll, um, be running around in a field somewhere eating in bugs and and uh doing whatever it is that field mice do so there's your mouse update for anyone who is interested thank you all for the emotional support of watching my mice grow for the last three days